There is something that God wants to do in our generation. One thing, He wants to get us ready for rapture. He want to get the church ready to return. We are not staying here again. And we must be well prepared for it. The greatest danger you will do is to miss the rapture. Nobody will be saved after the rapture. Don't deceive yourself. Nobody will be saved. If rapture takes place, nobody will go to heaven again. If you have not endured what is present, you can't endure what is coming. Check your life. When you saw my eye, was it not like as if I'm crying? Because I am feeling the bath of pain that is coming on this earth. I am feeling the pain that is about to engulf this planet. You are joking with Christ. Everybody is preaching. Everybody is warning you. Repent, repent. You can't repent. Something is behind. Something is coming. You, you, think, you think you have money. Your money will not save you that day. You think you know people. People will not save you that day. You think you are intelligent. It will not save you that day. Rapture is coming. And this rapture that is coming, I fear because even the church will miss the rapture. Even the church will miss that rapture. Repent. Repent of all your sins. Do you see the number of weddings going on? Do you see how many people are getting married every Saturday? Huh? Bible talk about it. It says when you see men giving out their children into marriage, it's a sign. It will come suddenly like the days of Lot. You think everybody is preaching. You are still pompous. You are still bragging because you are breathing. What was the research you saw yesterday? They said, what did they discover? Listen to what they, on the internet, what did they discover? Something what? A danger is approaching the earth. It's approaching the earth from another planet. I prophesied it in the church. I prophesied, I said, something is coming. This, your eye will melt inside. People will drive up on the street like this. If you can't hear the voice of the prophet, there's nobody will hear again. When I see people are still after what they feel and not after God, how many times have you given to God? How many hours have you given to God? How many hours? How long? If Jesus will come now, what have you done for Christ now? What have you done? What is your work on earth? Be playing with your life. I didn't come to preach. I came as a warner. Because what will befall the earth, it will shock humanity. You have one more chance before God. And that chance is the preachers that are available today. It was after, after we, we, we finished the wedding. He saw me like I'm crying. True. In the office. Is it no, you, you, why are you not seeing me? Yes, My sir. eyes were, yes, red. were red. And I told him, I said, I am feeling the pain of what is about to happen on earth. Do not trust your fame. Do not trust your riches. Do not trust your education. Do not trust who you know. Run after Jesus Christ. Some of you, you are still playing politics with the things of God. Run for your life. That day, no man will save you. That day, you don't have your pastor that will save you. That day, you don't have your prophet to save you. That day, you don't have an apostle to save you. That day, you don't have an evangelist to save you. You have only one chance. And that chance is to repent. If pastors will not say it, let the prophet say it. I owe no man apology. Listen, church. Listen. Listen and listen. Prepare yourself for the rapture. This night, breaking of today, I had a terrible vision about this church. People that I know, they miss rapture in this church. 
people that I know in the front seat, they lost rapture. I was watching how people were taking off. People in the choir lost rapture. Pastors, you lost rapture. I saw many of you seated down, you didn't go to heaven. Some of you, you are running up and down in this city, looking for where to put your head. You miss rapture. Repent. 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 This is what the Lord has sent me to tell you today. Can we rise to our feet? I fear what I saw in my vision. Go home, repent. Some of you, you are encouraging others in those days. Now people can't even encourage you. You are backslidden. Go and check your life. Some of you, you are praying four hours a day. Now 20 minutes you cannot pray. Go home now and pray. Not in the church. When the prophet came, he warned Hezekiah of the impending danger. What did Hezekiah did? He went back. I'm not preaching today. I'm not preaching. Service has ended. I have finished my own. I'm not preaching. I'm not prophesying. I'm not doing anything. We are closing the service now. Go and prepare your home. Danger is coming on the earth. Will you be before God? Or you will be before man? Those of you that are abusing other denominations, you will be shocked those in those churches will go to heaven. You here, you won't go to heaven. You will be shocked. You attended exosia and you are not in heaven. Go prepare your house. Did you hear what I said? Did you hear what I said? Yes, sir. Some of you, listen, some of you, today they are begging you to come to church. Don't come to church. Don't come. Don't come to church. I beg you, don't come to church again. There will be a day you will desire it. The Antichrist will stop it. What did I tell you yesterday? Yes, sir. I told you, I told him, I said, how many of you, you have not touched your handset today? How many of you, you have not seen your handset today? It will be very rare. Now, if the Antichrist come and said, if you don't have your number, you will use the handset. How many people can forfeit it? How many people can forfeit it? Few people. You should now know that the number 666 is at hand. Don't think they will give this number later. They will give this number presently in our world. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care again. I don't care again. Firstly, I'm a prophet. I'm not a pastor. Do you hear what I said? I am not a pastor. I am a prophet. Prophet, they are warners. They don't pay to you. They tell you what is to come. Yes, sir. I'm so sorry. Those that I saw in this church missing rapture, I pity them. Because they were zealous in the beginning and they have ended as ordinary men. Go and pray. Go and pray. Those of you who want to hear the word of God, meet me on Thursday. Father, thank you for today. We appreciate you for the service. As we go home, teach your word to those that are teachable. Give wisdom to those who seek wisdom. I thank you for I've delivered your message in Jesus' name.